Hello YouTubers, and we're out somewhere out in the wooden areas, woodland areas, as you see. And uh, we're just walking today, knowing the surroundings. Part of a ninja, our shinobi trait here. Um, Everything else. And you see, we're somewhere in the woods areas behind a what they call a um, glass plant. Yeah. And I'm doing a lot of looking around and stuff. As you can see, as you can see, there's a lot of good areas here. Very a lot. And then you see, leaves are starting to turn. Well, that's good. That's real good. Fall is really coming to be fall. Yeah, so I'm walking near railroad tracks. Yeah. This is where I'll be doing most of the stealth walking at. When we get to the stealth walking. You know, nice days like this, I like to take a walk. Calm my nerves down, no my surroundings. Stuff like that. You know, I mean, you can look everywhere you can look everywhere you get a lot of vegetation to do stealth in everything Right now I'm walking on some rocks. You might not can hear it right now. I'm going behind another plant. You can see this is there's a plant right there. Everything. And way off in the distance. You can see right there, way off in the distance, on that mountain ridge. Okay. Kind of hazy right now. And that's where we are doing is walking in an area that would be kind of pristine for me. Yep. Very pristine for me to uh, walk, think, know my surroundings, know what I can do, what I can't do. Very peaceful day. Very warm day. I just think of Shinobis used to walk a long while, you know, long miles. And right now, I'm about like two, three miles out. Out where, where I live at. All by myself. Out here, the only thing I got is my knife and my hands and feet. But it's really knowing your surroundings, knowing that 
what goes on in your surroundings is what you're gonna notice. What you're gonna notice about people. As you can see this, the skies are blue and everything. And everything like that. Up ahead, I've walked this area before. Up ahead, there's a um, train cart. That's pretty cool. I mean, thing was left there since the 1950s or 1959, somewhere around there. And it hadn't much deteriorated. Then I will probably show you around the park area. So all my areas that I can do videos in, I can do them. Uh, let's see how long this one. In six minutes. All right. Yeah, no surrounding video. see walking this brings you back down to a time where you think everything is going to be you know, hunky dory. I bet you this train track used to see a lot of days on their trains. Now it doesn't see anything. Abandoned. Abandoned tracks. Abandoned cart. brings me up to another little thing uh, about knowing surroundings, you know your surroundings, know where you're going, reconnaissance. I can do a lot of reconnaissance missions without have to be at wartime. That is pretty good because that will be part of my training, part of the training anyways, knowing your surroundings. So this is just a knowing your surroundings video, this is the very first one ever. Yeah. Always know where your nose is going. Always know where your nose is going. Well, yeah, how do you like that little effect? That's called Pamaram effect. I'm starting to learn how to do other types of uh, things for my camera. A lot of people say, what is this got to do with training? It's got everything to do with training. You gotta be one with nature, one with the universe, one with your surroundings, knowing your surroundings where you can hide in case emergency, stuff like that. And pretty soon you'll be coming near a railroad track. So. Uh, when we get there, that would be the end of the film. Or the video. The journey's half of the much is there. Maybe I can show you what that park looks like when I get there too, so. Yeah, that's right. Another angle. Oh, I love these angles. Believe it or not, there's that rear, there's that uh, car. Let's get up to it. Let's get up really up to it.
at that cart. I bet you that cart seen better days than sitting here rusting. Twelve eleven. 1956. This is when that when this card was issued. And it rode the track since then. I'm from Ohio. And there's the park right there. Uh, park here. Another area that I can do some pretty amazing stuff there. Since now summertime is over with, the park is just usually a park easy to for team for training purposes only. And that's the end of the video today. It's 11 minutes. Damn, this is a long video.